All right, so many businesses in Utah working so hard to stay open for us. We love to highlight them. It's Big Buddha's job, and he is at Afterword for our segment called We're Open in Utah. Hey, it's We're Open in Utah. We're up here at uh, Heber, and it's called Afterward. I'm telling you, that name, you can have it before, in the middle, and afterward, and the food is amazing. This is really, really good. My eyes are already full. Nick. Perfect, perfect. Nice job. How would you describe the style of cuisine? Is it Southwestern? Is it Americana? What, what would you say? Uh, so I think we're kind of a uh, refined, um, probably like more... I don't know. I would say it's probably like just comfort food. Com you know oh, what yeah, I mean? Like yeah, With yeah. a southern influence. Yeah. Especially if it's cold, you know, you, you want to bring the heat of fast. Course. You know, and a good food will do that to you. Correct. So we're upscale, but we're comfort food. Okay. What do so, you got? Let's show off some. What do you, what do you brought with you? Uh, so we have our staple deviled eggs. Mm -hmm. So you have deviled eggs with a little bit of crispy ham on top. Then, of course, we have our biscuits. These are all house-made every day. They are wonderful. People just are, they just die for them. Okay. Uh, I love, I love that they're small. I don't feel guilty if I eat two. <laughs> it's a perfect starter. You know what I mean? You can share it between the table, and it's, uh, it's just kind of that, just it gets your palate rolling. Yeah, so. yeah, very good. Next, we have our uh, smoked trout salad, a little bit of shaved fennel, compressed apples, and uh, candy pecans, just dressed lightly in a little bit of sherry vinegar and lemon oil. And then uh, we just have a new item here, which is our burrata, which is locally made, actually, at Caputo's. And uh, a little bit of grapefruit for some nice acidity, house-made granola, a little bit of sherry reduction. And then um, we also put a little bit of lemon oil on there. And this is sorrel, which is, has a nice uh, citrusy feel to it. Now, obviously, we, we partner with All in Utah with these segments as we're going out and visit businesses like yourselves, because you guys are open, you're safe, and you're trying to get people to come in. Where, as far as how you're facilitating being open as a business, is it just in dining, curbside, pickup? What 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 are some of those resources? So we offer using? everything basically. Okay. So if people want to do curbside, we we offer a small menu that um, basically allows people to have a dinner between two to three people, sometimes up to four, depending on you know the size of the meal. Uh, but we also offer in, we have a, that beautiful tent outside for uh, you know outdoors, um, but you're also kind of indoor. And then we have this beautiful little dining room, and, and we're good to go. All right. Well, let's uh, make sure we send some business to uh, our friends here at Afterwards because they are open for you guys, Utah. What's your website for more information? Afterwardrestaurant.com. All right. And ours is fox13now.com. Send anybody who could use some We're Open in Utah shine to fox13now.com. Back with more. See you.